Yes, so my, I'm here. Oh, it says food and drink, so that's okay. But it's typical of me to want to go to a way, to a place where the road is like this. Okay, so I'm not the only one with this idea. <laughs> There's also some kind of resort kind of stuff here. So that didn't show on the map. It looks abandoned, but I think people are still here. Yeah, this will do. This will do totally fine. Can't complain about that, can you? Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm a little sweaty, but I can't believe I'm... I don't want to go home, but can you blame me? Oh, but I, I, oh no, I'm not going to sum up this journey yet. Not yet. It's not over. It's not, I tell you, it's not. Let's go swim. So, when I went into the ocean, this was all in sun. And now I have a black shadow like that. So I've been in the water for quite some time. It's just amazing just to lie there. Thank you, I know. There's supposed to be like a walking way to another beach here. And that is a bigger beach called Tub Tim, Tim Tub, something like that. Oh, that's the bird, still here. This was a nice, nice beach. This would be nice to stay uh, like this. I thought it would be like a path. Well, it is a path, but it's made. We'll see what happens. That's the beach I came from. And whoo, now I'm sort of uh, out on, uh, like uh, on a tip here. And I'm going there. Well, uh, look out, all you vegan and vegetarian people in the world. We have a vegetarian view with here out on the islands. Yes, yes, yes. And now we come to Tab Tim Beach, which is, Tab Tim is a big resort. And here yeah, is much more like chairs and stuff here. It's not too big though. Not that big. This is the biggest one I've seen yet. This is a sort of like a bridge, well, in front of a boat. It's like a front of a boat and you can, yeah, and then you can swing it from there to there. Happy hour, buy one, free one. Oh, happy hour, everybody. I could have actually just kept on going here. And uh, eventually, I'm gonna go, go get to my uh, hometown. Uh, but I have a scooter over here, so I, I was, I thought that I wanted to like go for a swim again, but uh, apparently not. So now I'm just uh, gonna turn around and walk all the way back and uh, to the to the beach I came from. So now I'm back at my beach again. I was over there on the other side there. Now I'm back and I've been going up here. This is a more like natural trail. So we'll see if I can get to another beach. I think I will. So when that comes, I need to go down here. It's very black stone here. 
you go down here. When I'm coming back, it's gonna look like this. Black stone, yeah. It's just after that. Coming here, look like this. Found a little bigger trail, bigger trail here. I see civilization. I don't know if they, if it's supposed to look like that on the nose, or if it has a disease. No, the this one is a younger one. Yes, <laughs> can I walk? Can I walk here? <laughs> you never know what they might think. So, so this is Saukav Beach, and. Yeah, doesn't it look nice? And they have like a pier here as well. My goodness gracious. I mean, isn't this... Oh, they have a, a pride flag here. So nice. Uh, with Bob Marley. Maybe it's a Jamaican guy. <laughs> but isn't this what... It looks like an island life. You have palms, you have bungalows. Someone is painting a table. Someone is swinging for the life. A random boat is lying ashore waiting to get in the sea. And some has done his job, its job. The billiard playing is full on. Some random horse and another animal that I can't really describe. All of this makes an island an island vibe. I don't know what I'm saying. But it, make, yeah, it makes you feel the island vibe. Feel it. Feel it, I tell you. Oh, no, is what? Is that a boat in front of the house or is it made to look like a boat underneath? I have to check that out. Well, looky, looky, yes. The bottom of this house is a boat. So it's sort of like a narrow boat but it's still like it's a houseboat it's a houseboat people be amazed i need to write this down because i really like the vibe of of this part this this beach because it it was really nice and the bars and the restaurants looks like very, very casual like uh, very relaxed and uh, yeah a nice vibe but more can i tell you Nothing. I wonder if it's been like, if it said something here, or well, maybe they just put it on. I don't know. But now it's just black. It's black. Yes, it's Sai Q Beach. Sai Q Beach. If you want to have that island vibe, where everything is lazy and it looks a little bit like, uh huh. But I love this when it's not like perfect. You know, I. Adore it. Well, I stopped here and I asked, uh, I wanted to have a drink here, so I'm gonna get it. What do you recommend? I said, and said, she said, a pina colada, and that's what I'm having. And I'm gonna sit there and look at the ocean, and uh, she asked me, do you want it strong? So it's like, it's not. I could, I could say a strong one or, or not so strong, so, and I'm saying not so strong. Well, people, I got stuck here, in one of those. I'm looking out to the sea, thinking about nothing. Yeah, that was really, really, really lovely. But I have to go now before it gets dark, because I'm going through the woods and uh, come back home. It's okay to drive in the dark. Uh, I, uh, I did that yesterday, but walking through the woods here, I don't want to do in the dark was here, yeah. Ooh.
Oh, I have to go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna hurt you. <laughs> I just want to walk here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you never know about these gooses or whatever they are. So, yeah, let's get into the jungle. Now I come to the junction where I went down here. But when I look at the map, and I'm using maps.me, you, you download the map and then you can use it on offline. And it seems like going down there, then I go down to the beach and then I have to go up again to the motorbike. But it seems like if I just continue do, going this, I, I sort of get to the motorbike directly. So I do that because I don't need to go down to the, to the beach again. I need to go to the motorbike. And here it is, time to go up the hill. So here you see the big pond. That was over there when there was the, the light festival. Oh, they're taking away the big lotus flower in the middle with a, yeah. Okay, I haven't seen this before. So uh, a little lake here in the middle of town. Uh, and the Buddhists are out and about. Oh yeah, and all the way here, there's uh, like uh, local restaurants and stuff. And I'm back uh, now to this, uh, to the beautiful bar. and see if uh, I can get some food here. Hopefully, hopefully some food. completely empty here. This is sort of way off, off the off the track. And the man who was working here was sitting in that chair and was sleeping. So I was like going my way out and then he saw me and was like, oh, blah, blah, blah. So now I'm sitting here having my... And uh, the water is there and waiting for my food. Hopefully this place will, will uh, manage to survive because it's um, yeah it's such a lovely place Ooh, i have some news you know that i prolonged one day so i i have one more day i'm, I'm very very happy about that i sort of had like three options i think how i would spend it one option is going to the big beach very close to where i live the second is is uh, renting a scooter again and doing sort of like I did today, going to some different uh, uh, beaches. And the third option, going on a boat tour again. Mm, I gave it a, some thought. I was like, yeah, going to the big beach was like, oh, that's not so fun. Today was terrific, but then there's not so many more beaches to go to. I was like, should I do the same thing again? Like, and then I was like, no, I think I want to do the boat tour because it's sort of very relaxing because you don't have to think and, and you go to a lot of different, like, nice beaches and you'll be on the sea with, on a boat, which is also very, very nice. So, yeah, so I've ordered a boat tour. So that's gonna to be my last day here. Sad, though. Okay, so I got my food and it came in a bag. But it's only 60 bucks. That's nothing. So this will be interesting if it's... It might be very, very good. It might be... It's not that much, but... Maybe this is a bar more, but... Oh, well, now I eat. Bye, bye, bye. It was very, very, very good. It's a ginger dish with the chicken and rice. It wasn't as spicy as I wanted, but I will still give it um, half an M, so a small M for this one at this lovely place. It's half past eight. Um, uh, and I just uh, gave the, the motorbike key to the reception here because he won't be here because he's taking people to Chiang Mai, to, to Kushang, probably. So yeah, I've returned the, the, the key uh, to, to the reception. And I'm back at the hotel. And 
once again a little bit sad because I have made my last hotel booking for this journey. At the restaurant, I looked up uh, hotels because now I, I know where, where I, when I'm going to uh, Bangkok. I've been looking uh, around for a few days and uh, this uh, it came up again and it was, yeah. It, it, it's also on the line, on the metro line that goes directly to the airport. So then it's very easy for me to go to the airport uh, when I'm going back home to Sweden. I, I've been much better. I, I, I remember the first trip I, I did to Southeast America, America, a long trip, was in 2016. A lot of times I booked the hotel when I was on the minibus going to that place. And that is fine when I'm like, when you haven't decided sort of uh, when to go. But uh, I've been much better now and, and um, sort of booking the hotels like a few days before I go there. Because yeah, as soon as I sort of uh, have decided when to leave to the next place. Uh, so it feels really, um, it feels not stressed at all. And it's a uh, very, yeah, I go to the agoda i use agoda uh, agoda is very very good in asia and i also do look at booking.com but agoda mostly so yep there you have it looking forward to tomorrow though uh boat trip coming up and um, it's going to be a great day uh but now i'll bid you Ooh.